years ago, God began to deal with GLOBE about a couple of things. One was that we really needed to focus on a whole new generation of young people to recruit them and to train them and to send them out as missionaries all over the world. The second thing was that we needed to refocus on our foundations. Really that missions, first and foremost, is about making disciples and, and planting churches wherever our missionaries go. It was just interesting how we ended up starting back into that refocus. I'm a surfer. I love to surf. About seven years ago, a good friend of mine here in Pensacola and a local chiropractor, Buck Waters, he and I got together and started the first Christian Surfers chapter here in Pensacola. And that initiative exposed me to a whole new generation, a whole new group of young people who love to surf, were ready to travel anywhere in the world to preach the gospel if it gave them a chance to surf. In the summer of 2005, I was at a Christian Surfers conference where Mike Doyle spoke. Mike Doyle is the outreach director of Walking on Water. Walking on Water is a surf ministry and uh, Christian filmmaking company. They make surf films and preach the gospel message through the medium of the film and the sport of surfing. And Mike was sharing with us about how Walking on Water was taking these films and really reaching thousands of young people all over the world. I was mesmerized by what Mike was sharing, coming on the back of God dealing with us about reaching with young people and that kind of thing. So after the workshop was over, I went up to Mike right away and I said, look, you and I have got to talk. And so we chatted for a little bit there at the workshop and then we went out for coffee afterwards and he asked me what I wanted and I said, I want us to partner together, Globe and Walking on Water, and do an outreach with one of our missionaries somewhere in the world. In July 2006, uh, I led a team of pastors and young people from Pensacola. We met a team coming from San Diego, California, which was made up of professional surfers and skateboarders, Christian guys and their wives. We all convened at Overton House in uh, Scotland, where Bob and Melissa Hill lead their ministry, and we did a week-long skate and surf outreach to the young people of that area. So Doug called me up and goes, Bob, I got this really great idea, and you know, I, I want you to think I thought of Scotland, I thought this will work in Scotland, and so I hung up and I go, oh, right, you know, I know one skateboarder, he's a jerk, and uh, he's in my church, I just want to punch him, and uh, oh, this will never work. Doug was persistent, he sent me stuff when walking on water, and and, uh, and then he calls and says, you know what, uh, uh, Mike Doyle and I are going to come over and, and visit. And, you know, I said, okay, good. So they came over and, and uh, go to visit the skateboard park. Now, I, I called him and I said, Chick, you know, is it okay if we do this? And he said, uh, cool. So in the summer, they came over and we had hundreds of kids show up. And, I mean, we'd been there for 11 years and had worked our tails off with uh, a group of young people that were just could care less and we'd see a little bit of fruit. We never saw anything that uh, was like what we were hoping and then all of a sudden, you know, we're, we're having hundreds of kids, we're having, you know, 50 or so kids at each meeting, you know, raise their hand and pray to receive the Lord. And, and within a year they had over a hundred kids and now they're going on, closing in on 150 kids every week coming out. It's the biggest youth ministry in the nation of Scotland. It's been a phenomenal story of young people coming to Christ through the avenue of skate and surf. Uh, that led us to do a second outreach in the summer of 2007 in Germany and we had the same kind of results and although the growth of the follow-up work is a little slower there, we believe that in time it's going to be the same thing. <music> In January this year, I led a team of five missionaries, Globe missionaries, and a filmmaker from Walking on Water to Sri Lanka, to China, to Indonesia, and Thailand. 
And in Sri Lanka, we did an outreach among a people group that I've worked with in the past, and planted another church. Then we went to China and did the preliminary planning. Mike Doyle joined us and did the planning for an outreach that we're going to do this summer in China with our missionaries there and plant a new youth church. Went down to Indonesia, did some planning there for another outreach and youth church that we'll do this summer. And so it's really interesting how God is opening doors for all these church planting initiatives to happen all over the world right now. I am uh, very excited about that and how it's um, in some ways revolutionizing Globe, Globe's missionaries and some of our missionary ministries in new ways to do church planting. Two years ago, you were very generous to us and helped us with the outreach in Scotland in the summer of 2006. That same banquet you gave that helped us with the outreach we did in Germany in the summer of 2007. And today, both those ministries are growing and having a real impact on young people in two countries. Now this summer, we're going to two new places and we need your help again. We need your help to send a team to Kunming, China to help our missionaries there. And we need your help in Bali, Indonesia to start another youth ministry in that place. You've been generous to us. You've been a blessing to Globe missionaries all over the world. And we need your help again. And so we thank you for whatever you can do for this new thrust into a new place. Mm -hmm.